Hey, what's up, guys? I'm TPB Robinizer. Today, I am bringing you guys my Season 1 Week 6 battle for the SBL. My Week 6 opponent is Justin, who is 3-2, uh, and two, so he's not... Um, Record-wise, he's worse than us, but he's uh, a great team builder. <laughs> that's that's his strong suit. He's really good at team building. And, um, yeah, let's get right into it. I have, uh, on, the, on the right, uh, Scarf Ditto. Focus Sash Sneasel, um, Tapu Fini, um, Agility, Sword Sands, Blaziken, Scarf Bulu, and then a Speedy Defensive Mesprit. <clears throat> so my game plan was, okay, I need to beat Jellicent, and then Blaziken can sweep, and then if I lead Scarf Bulu, it's not standard, he won't expect it, he usually leads Greninja, I can kill it. So... My goal is to kill it. I lead with my Scarf Bulu, and as he usually does, he leads with Greninja. Now, I think Greninja is the biggest threat to my team offensively. It beats Mesprit. It beats Tapu Fini. It beats Tapu Bulu. It beats Blaziken. It beats everything. So, I go for Woodhammer. And he has a Sash. He has a Focus Sash, and kills me with a Gunk Shot. So, I am, uh... At this point, I, I'm just like, no! Why? And then, um, I was kind of tilted at this point, because I was like, okay, no one's going to expect Scarfed Bulu, but he expects Scarfed Bulu. Like, this is what I mean when he's really good at team building. So I bring in Sneasel, and I just go for an Ice Shard. I try and pick up my kill, and uh, he brings in Clefable. Um, I switch out into Ditto, and I want to scout out the set, and I see he has Stealth Rocks, Fire Blast. Um, I can't remember. This is It's actually been a while since I played this game. Soft Boiled, and then uh, I think Moon Blast. So I go for Stealth Rocks, and because uh, I'm Scarfed, he smartly brings in Greninja, and uh, I don't get to kill him. I bring in Mesprit because this is useless now. He goes for he goes for a gunk shot, thinking Feeny will come in, and uh, Mesprit comes in and then just dies to a Dark Pulse. Crit did not matter. I bring in Ditto, and I see his set, and I um, I think the thing I didn't see was Water Stab. Um, I just go for Dark Pulse to get damage off. Um, Zygarde takes not much at all from this. And he goes for a thousand arrows and it does not beat Feeny. Um, he goes for another thousand arrows, gets a crit, which sucks because Feeny can't do anything now. And, uh, I get a crit, but, uh, he lives, he lives the moon blast and that's stupid because I could have just went for, a uh, ice beam. So, uh, misplay on my part, but, you know, he's got... He has tons of Moonblast switch-ins. Switch uh, I get my own Zygarde, and I just think I need to spam Thousand Arrows. And uh, with a high roll, you know, I'm at a point where I can... No, he recovers, my bad. But I was at a point where with a high roll I could have killed him, but, you know, he recovers. Don't get it. And I'm Scarfed, so he gets the Cursed Body, and I have to struggle. And I get burned, which means I can't live another... Uh, well, I couldn't anyway, but I couldn't live a rock switch in. So, there's that. Burn, do zero damage, and struggle to death. And at this point, I think... Okay, if Jellicent dies, Blaziken still wins. Blaziken can still win. Um, I sh Honestly, I should have gone for Pursuit there. Um, I would have won if I went per for Pursuit, I think. And we see this is a Magic Guard Clefable, so Sword Stance will kill it. Go for Ice Cold Crash, get a Lucky Flinch, and get a little bit of damage off. But in the end, the flinch didn't matter, because I missed my next Ice Cold Crash. And he kills Sneasel with the Moon Blast. And then I bring in Blaziken and think, oh no, I just need to preserve Differential. Go for Agility. Does 41%. I'll live another. I can go for Sword Stance and kill Clefable. Um, he kills me with a crit. <laughs> So, uh, basically, what happened was, Bulu died, and that was the thing 
that was the thing I needed to stay alive, to take on Jellison. And then after that, just um, I just got tilted a bit, but I didn't. Oh my God, nice OBS. But uh, I got tilted a bit, and I uh, started playing bad. And then I I wasn't really tilted too much. I thought I still have Blaziken. Blaziken wins. But then uh, you know just the the little bits of hacks in the end just um, you know it tilted me and I played really poorly. Um, I think my prep was good, but as I said, Justin is like the best prepper in the league, and he out prepped me for sure. He had like a defensive Venusaur for a to take on Bulu. Um, he had a SD or a, not an SD, a Dragon Dance sub Zygarde. And that uh, that took me on. Um, he brought thousand arrows because it beats my team, except for Bulu. But then he brought Sludge Wave, which kills Bulu, even though Zygarde has like 80 special attack. But uh, overall, he out prepped me. And you know, a lot of people say this, but prep is half the battle. And he beat me in that part. And then in the play, you know, I is I don't know. I just didn't play very well. But I am now four and two with a plus four, plus four or plus three differential. Justin is also four and two. Um, yeah, my next week opponent is Anon, Anon, however you want to say it, and uh, trying to pick up a win there. But uh, that is gonna be it for you guys. See ya.